All right, once again, I thought I was out of here and all finished, but there's a little pet peeve of mine, something I want to rant about that you've heard me talk about, shops don't pay attention to. RTFM, use the right procedures, use the right equipment. So here I am uh, starting the system, and as I notate and look up, and I'm taking my readings, my eyes finally notice that uh, there is absolutely no zero zip zilts coolant in this system. They've been running this vehicle in this, the shop here. They just took it over to a mechanical shop who took over, to, had to take out the radiator to condenser the bypass, the glycol loop, and replace the condenser. Then it came from that mechanical repair shop and was delivered back here. Then they called me up to come down and it's been going in and out of the shop and over to the other mechanical shop with no coolant in the system. And I said, huh, okay. So I turn off the car and this is the coolant bypass loop coming over here. And I go, let's feel, this has been running. The engine is hot. There is literally no coolant, the line is ambient 60 degrees outside the line is cool the line is cool all the line everything is cool because there's no coolant in the system they literally have been driving this around with no coolant in the system that is bad loop nothing 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 and this is this is one of my things I get a little upset about shops, uh, how they treat customers on the coolant, nothing. There's no warmth at all. There's nothing in this system. And they've been driving it like this. Son of a bitch. And this is an AMG. Do you know how expensive it would be to replace this engine? This is a hand-built engine from Germany, dual, dual turbos. I better not say it anymore because I'm gonna upset some people. But uh, you know how I am about cars being driven without coolant. Because they say, oh, it's just being driven down the street or across the street and just moved a couple times. It shortens the life of a lot of components. It may not fail while it's in your shop, but I really feel sorry for this customer in the future. He may have a very, very expensive coolant related repair bill. And I see this day in and day out. See you guys. Think about it. RTFM.